All right. We are going to work on our sight words now. Our sight words are he, for. Let's look at them again. He, for. The word he, when you say he, you're talking about a boy. He, for. So, and this is the word for, meaning something is for someone. So, not the number for. Okay, this is something is for someone. He, for. Let's say them again together. Your turn. He, for. Blank has a pan. He has a pan or for has a pan. Which word do you think best fits that sentence? He. Okay, now since this is the beginning of a sentence, we need to make sure that that H is uppercase because an uppercase letter starts a sentence. He. He has a pan. Okay, we're going to go across. Blank likes the pan. He likes the pan or four likes the pan. Which word best fits that sentence? He, he likes the pan. Now this is the start of a sentence here also. So we've got to make sure that H is an uppercase letter as an uppercase letter starts a sentence. He likes the pan. All right, moving down. The pan is blank you. The pan is he you, or should we say the pan is for you? Which word best completes that sentence? He is for you. The pan is for you. Sorry. The pan is for you. Okay. So this is all lowercase letters, but that F is a tall letter, okay? Next, it is blank Pam. It is he Pam or it is for Pam. Which word best fits there? For. It is for Pam. Okay. Very good.